as well too. So here we are. It is 5.09 a.m. on October 19th, 2019. And we're in the car going to run the Huntsville half. Huntsville half. It smells like cat pee in here. Because one of us took the cats to the vet last week and didn't clean her car. But I guess that's kind of how we roll because there's still nephew pee in here from <laughs> July. Can we just clarify? Someone didn't take cats to the vet once. Someone went to the vet three times in two weeks. And one of them... How is that relevant to the whole pee situation? How? I just... Here we go. Okay. This will be fun. All right. It is 725. Uh, we did get here. It is somewhat difficult to find this place, especially in the dark. And they didn't turn the signs on until the lights came or until the sun came out. So I don't mean to be negative. I just have to complain a little bit. Okay, I do mean to be negative. And again, this is a race. I don't know how many hundreds of people there are here. They have four porta potties. And I went into one of them at O Dark 30, and someone had already pissed all over the seat. So I left that one and went into the other one. I mean, like the first person that uses it just pisses all over everything. Now there's only three. Um, Some desperate person will wipe that down. Well, uh, yeah. And there's, it's a loop course. I mean, you're out here in the middle of nowhere at the fairgrounds. Why does it have to be a loop? Anyway. So that's, that's two kilos off already. We haven't even started. <laughs> oh, but it's the 41st annual. So you'd think we would have gotten it right by now. Yeah. So we'll see you at the start. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Make sure you cross over the black dot so that we get your start time. Don't go around it, please. We want to make sure we get your official time for our race today. See you, Jody. Here we are. A mile four at the turn around. Still bullshit. <laughs> oh, it's fun. Here we come back on the main highway. <laughs> Thank you. Almost to mile five. There's hills out. In a second loop. There's some more. Whew. Halfway. That's Goku. I'm not sure I got on fast enough. Here's this lady trying to. Thank you. I got this. Okay. One more. I'm gonna die. Here comes Jeremy. He looks about like I feel. <laughs> He's getting it to it though. Jerry found out from Wonderton, he heard the footsteps of Leah Lee from Austin. 
Good job, dude. Here's the metal showcase. Huntsville half finisher 2019. Pretty neat, simple. Says what, where, and when. Not bad. More people coming in. It's a tough race. All right, we're sitting here at the end waiting for lunchbox. These are the Brooks Revel or Revel or whatever. I usually run in glycerins, but I bought these because they have a slightly smaller drop <clears throat> than the glycerins. Figured I'd give them a shot here. Uh, they actually worked out pretty good. I ran one four mile little jaunt in them and then this half marathon today. I don't know. Pretty good. I still think I need a 15 versus the 14, which is here. But the 15s hurt. They give me all kinds of weird things. These ones, my toes are almost to the end. But anyway, pretty cool. I did buy some new glycerin, so I'm going to try them next and see what happens. All right, lunchbox got to be coming around soon. Huh? Still some finishers rolling in. Quite a few people. It's a very pretty day. All right. Someone threw up. Here goes lunchbox, walking it in. Oh, she saw me. Now she's running. Good for her. Let her catch up here. Go lunch, Fox. How'd it go? It was good. Definitely ran out of fuel mile 11. Um, and the hills were a challenge, but I was nice to myself, That's and it was a good race. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Guess who placed third in our age group? Oh my god, good for you. <laughs> anyway. Um, are you going to be okay? <laughs> there's just so many emotions. Um, they're not all normal emotions, but what the fuck, whatever. I placed third in my age group. The woman who beat me only beat me by five minutes. <laughs> or the second place, I should say. That's probably first place. It's probably a normal human being. Good for you. Thanks. How did you even figure that out? Well, I was walking up to go change my clothes, and the guy, uh, he'd been at the finish line when I finished, and he said, you, you placed third in your age group. I was like, that's really funny. And he goes, no, really, here, I have the paper. And he showed it to me. And I said, so what you're saying is there are only three women who ran age 35 to 39. He said, so far. <laughs> anyway, so that is officially the second time I've placed third. We've got to do more of these small races. I know. I think I came in fourth. Aww. Although, if I had done the quarter, uh -huh. I would have liked One. one. <laughs> yeah. I was very nice to myself and stayed very positive. I found the hills to be challenging on the second loop because uh, my legs are actually cramping right now. But they were a good challenge. It wasn't like I was crying or anything. It was just, it was difficult. And then I ran out of fuel at mile 11. So I started run walking, uh, which I mean, I, I think it probably added an extra seven or eight minutes to what my time would have been anyway. I think I would have been under three hours in this. I think I was 3.02 or I don't know. But great first race to get back into it and I, I have to say even though this was a loop course i'm not going to take a kiano off for that because the loop was interesting and mostly in the shade so they earned that kiano back so i'm going to take one kiano off for not putting an address on the race website and just assuming we all know where walker county fairgrounds are um but overall these people were nice i thought the aid stations were great everybody was polite um yeah i'm gonna give it four kianos out of out of five all right yeah i'm gonna probably give it four too i was gonna probably just for what she said not being able to find it very easily if you're not from here but the porta potty thing was bad and the loops yeah i usually take one off for that but i don't know i still think they could have done a, a full course but i mean there's enough roads around here 
but anyway. Yeah. It is what it is. It was fun. And I probably do this one again. Although it's so far away. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Alright. Um, thanks for watching.